This summer we'll pack some picnic lunches in a cooler and we'll just travel. See, I'm already making plans for you. Oh, wait a minute. What'd you see? Oh, it was just a, it was, it was just a flower. Oh, never mind. I don't need to take a picture of it. I'm sorry. I do that a lot. I'm in no rush. I'll try not to. Yeah, that sounded like fun. Because I always enjoyed going out places with you anyway. Traveling. We both have the same eye for stuff. And we like, we enjoy doing the same thing, so. Now that's a good barn picture. If you could step out there in the field and get that. I think I can. Because it don't look like I can see it very good from up there. No, step right out. I hope it's... Good shot of the clover? I did. I may not get you out of the area if I keep making you stop. That's one thing about being retired. I don't really worry about it. I don't live by a clock anymore. Me neither. It's dark. I go I to take bed. a lot more naps, though. I do. About two in the afternoon. <laughs> I go in and all of a sudden, Keith's home. I says, oh, what time is it? Oh, I've been sleeping two hours. Crying out loud. But it feels good to get rested up like that. I know. I, I still sleep all night. trees overhang the roads. Me too. Like a canopy. Yep. See, that was a perfect spot to take a picture of that barn because it's not so wonderful up here. You know what I mean? Not that it isn't wonderful, but... flowers on the front of it. That were a bad shot. What's going on with these pine trees turning like this? I don't know if it's some kind of evasive bug on them or what. I noticed that 
especially along the interstate the other day. I thought maybe it was a road salt or something that was killed. Well, that could be too. There's some hyacinths right there. Oh, stop here. Oh my God, Keith, look at those flowers. You gotta get out. I'm sorry, these look like peas. Sixty camera, right by your leg. I'm gonna put this up. Film the back road with this. Where we're going. It won't fall off there, will it? Yeah. Yeah, I have a trip. Stays right in front of 
place. Just have to watch out for the washboards. Yeah, it'll stay there for, it'll film for a half an hour and then it'll shut off. I won't go nuts over stopping. I bet there's fawns laying all over these fields. Well, I'd rather stop when you feel like it because if you don't, you'll never see it again. It'll be different next time. It is. Even people say, where'd you take that? And it's like, I sometimes I do the same loop over and over again, different time of year. It just doesn't even look the same. And they, it changes, so you get a different scenery. Colors are different each year. Different shades of green are different every year. I mean, I even like the toadstools on, on the dead trees. <laughs> oh, this looks like a good stone. Yeah, you and I like, like the same stuff. It's a pretty stone. Time's gone by. Old maple tree. Stood for probably hundreds of years. It probably. takes them another 50 to die. Yeah, they just keep People on coming. People think they're dead and they live for another 50 years. Then you see a branch pop out of the part of it and it starts growing all over again. Now there's a lot of cedar through here. Everett used to cut cedar for me. Did Used a lot of it in the house. Did the, my entire bedroom out of cedar. I wonder if his son is taking over the sawmill or... If... I see he's got selling his tractor. I had it for sale there on Facebook the other day. Yeah, I'd imagine his older son, the grandson, ain't really probably, wouldn't it probably be his son? I wonder who got, who actually got the, the farm. I'm sure they, they're the type that would probably, they share. Who knows? Well, they pro it looks kind of like they all got land there because they all live around there. Yeah, he always wanted his kids around him. Yeah, boy, he... They all have like these wonderful trades too. You know, they do like some amazing things. sun comes through in the different spots. I know. Oh, look, look at that old sugar house right there. Two of them. That's one right there too, I think. Well, that makes it easy for you to see, doesn't it? Pretty much know just what you're getting when you take it with yours. Oh yeah, you can see the whole thing. But it's got a lot of space on it. Oh yeah, I bought more. 
for the pictures. Yeah. I bought these uh, notebooks like that you connect to them and they all hold four terabytes of uh, space. Instead of buying space from them, I buy the storage space. Then I transfer everything onto my storage books. Like I'll label one 1923, no, 24, and every year I get a new book to put all the videos and the pictures in. See, that's what I need to do. I don't know how to do any of that. They only cost $100, and all you do is, you, have you got a plug-in on that? For oh, yeah. You can plug it in in the car, like yours. No, but I mean a, a UPS port. No, um, because I wanted to get a card reader for it. because, And it says that you can, but I bought a couple and I couldn't get them to work. Let me see your side of that and see if you got a UPS port. That's a card there. What's this? That's where I plug it in to charge it. You have one. I think I got one of those cards at home. I'll bring it up to you. It's not the, it's not the regular card. It's just, it's for a storage card. But I don't see. I wouldn't know how to do it. I don't see a. So that's usually be your UPS port, but there's none in it. Uh, BJ took me to get this on my laptop shit to bed and he got and I said I don't I don't want an is iPad. Is this Windows 11? No, I don't know what it is. It's a, uh, it's an Apple iPad. Oh, Apple. Well, it's an Apple product. Yeah. And it was the newest one that they had and that was like 3 years ago. I'm sure they've come out with a newer one. But BJ said this is all you're going to ever want. Your for what you do. I think they charge it two ninety nine a month. For, yep, that's what I did. I yeah. I took that because it's pretty unlimited. Yeah, I got I got that same one. That's a pretty tree over there, isn't it? Yeah. What are, what kind of those are the bushes I planted. I don't know if they're Very gonna come off. So, oh those are those are a wild onion, those purple balls. No, those the are ones, peonies. Yeah, the peonies. Pink. That's the ones I I've got some of those. I don't know if they're going to come up or not because I just planted them. How long did they take to come up? Oh, they'll come up the first year. That's an azalea. It's a beautiful one, too. Yeah, it is. It's big. That's hosted in front of it. Those green leaves? Yep. I have tons of those in different kinds. I screw everything up or I forget. 
get a password and I say, oh my God. I know. We should, they should implant a chip in our brain so that every time we stuck our head on our computer and start up. I know. Well, they did facial recognition. <laughs> yeah, but they keep telling me it's not me. BJ, BJ was telling me that, that they follow everything we do through our devices, that they hear what we're talking about and oh, everything. Sure. I said, really? He goes, haven't you ever noticed that you'd be talking about something and all of a sudden stuff pops up on your thing? And I said, yeah. And he goes, well, that's because they pick up. Well, I'm glad they're I said, what if they're shut off? He goes, no, they still can do it. I don't even worry about such things because I don't really care. Well, I don't do anything that's bad, so yeah. I don't care either. As long as you're not watching me. Which is this road? Oh, wait a minute. Yep, it is. It ain't very wide. Well, go down it. We'll... If we if we need to turn around, we will. I think it comes out. I think it's like turns into a wider one later on. It's a skinny little thing. It didn't say dead end or anything. No, but I don't think we can get there from here. We just we have to go there first. We just have to go slow. Yeah, I end up backing up for two miles. No place to turn around. scaring you wrong but I think I've been down this road before but of course I have a truck so uh, we could turn around here if you want to if you if you're not sure but I think it does hook on to another road a farm off in the distance maybe it comes out there looks like a snowmobile trail <laughs> first time you come to get me and take me out and I, I you should have packed that picnic lunch we might need it after all <laughs> and they never were heard from again <laughs> Well, they have GPS on all these cars now, so they'll find us. <laughs> <laughs> I got my crutches, so we can hobble out somewhere. Yeah, we'll put one of those AirPod uh, patches on. What do they call them? Oh, my God. Those where they follow everybody? iPod? No, I don't know what they are. They're little tracking devices. They stick oh, a GPS. Their, yeah, like on their suitcases and stuff. They don't lose their luggage. God, I hope I'm not like steering you wrong. I think I've been down this road though. Not better than some of the main roads. About the same amount of potholes. Oh yeah, see it widens out again. Well, hell, big dog gone. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're safe. I was pretty sure I'd been on it before. Probably don't plow in the winter, though. I'll say to Donnie, stop right up here. I want to get a picture of those mushrooms on that tree, those toadstools on that tree. And he goes, well, how the hell do you know there's toadstools on that tree? And I said, because I've taken pictures of them before. <laughs> Every year. <laughs> See how they're doing. <laughs> I say, you're crazy. You must have to buy a lot of braids. <laughs> stop and go.